Hello friends, I am architect Sonu Rai from Glad Studio and from today onwards I am going to start Lumion 10 tutorial. So, I am going to start Lumion 10. So, let's begin. And if you click Lumion 10 here, this window will pop out. And I will also tell you how you can uh, work at minimum graphics card like 2GB or 4GB at a student level. If you are uh, confident enough, uh, after learning Lumion, you can buy high configuration systems and you can refer Lumion websites. So when you will uh, open uh, Lumion and this welcome screen will appear here and uh, I, I will tell you how you can use 2GB graphics card for uh, learning Lumion at beginners level for a smaller scene so you can either uh, can have 2GB graphics or 4GB graphics at beginners level so this is for starting our new project so if you click here you can start your new project here and here you can refer some examples in Lumion scenes in Lumion 10 they are having some building projects so you can refer their scenes and this is for loading your previous scenes which you have worked and this is for saving your file like in every software and this is for save as file for first time you have to save as and after that you can save every time you can click save your scene so and this is new and learning so it will uh, appear when your internet connection will be there so i am going to start new here and after this uh, you, you are required to select this any of this terrain to start your project this is plain terrain this is forest environment and this is tropical environment this is white this is suburban environment and this is mountain range so you, uh, whatever uh, terrain you are comfortable with you can select that so i am going to select uh, this plain environment and now it's loading template So uh, this is the viewport in plain terrain which will uh, after opening Lumion you will get here. So th th here is some layers if you want to turn it off you can close this eye and you can show layers. If you are working in layers you can turn it on and turn it off from here. So I will tell you more details about this in coming tutorials and you can also add layer also and this is for placing objects in scene here and this is the import new model here if you want you have some rabbit or a sketch of file or max file or autocad uh, 3d file you can import here so we'll go in detail uh, in the next uh, tutorial and this is the imported models so i have worked previously in my project so you can import this so i will uh, suppose if i want to import this model i have worked previously so i can use this and you can place your model here model this is my rabbit file which i have worked earlier you have to escape and you have to use your left mouse to move around the project so this is the hospital building in revit files so this is my building project so if you want to change the material of the building you can use this material tab here you can click here and if you want to change the material you can select it from here we'll go in details in the upcoming tutorial this is the landscape if you click landscape if you want to change the terrain height and if you want to add water bodies and oceans and open street map and grass you can use landscape here so and now this is for weather setting here you want to change the settings of weather if you want to change the sun brightness cloud amount you can use these features 
and you can also change the cloud amount and sun brightness so we'll discuss it in detail in coming tutorials and this is the nature which where it is some plants and trees so you can use broad leaf conifers trees palm tree and likewise there are trees plants and flowers so you can use uh, various numbers of trees and plants to place in your scene and this is the added fine detail nature which is added in higher version of uh, lumion so you can use these also to place in your scenes and this is for people and animals so you can use this is women in 3ds boys you can uh, just get introduced with lumion so if you want to add animals also you can use animals in your scenes and marine life also next is effect so if you want to add a water feature effect so you can use this uh, feature here this is indoor so you have all the interior uh, like uh, tables sofas chairs so you can use you know scene so just i am giving a brief introduction about this this one is outdoor so this is the all the things which are we use in our outdoor scene is given here like benches buildings and some by default like pergolas and trellis you can use in your lighting also is like lamp post for exterior scenes and construction activities also added some signage is also added in lumion so you can use so you can refer this outdoor also and if you want to put a uh, like cars in your scene you can use these features so there are different varieties of cars available here also you can use a sports car suvs vans and buses also you can use you know scene so this is the lights so if you want to add a lighting like ies lighting in 3ds max into your scenes you can use this kind of lightings and there is also some by default omni lights you can use in your scene this will all uh, understand in the coming tutorials these are the area lights like 3ds max and this is some utilities features it's like uh, text grid cut and this is the sound sound feature if you want to add sound in your scene you can use this in your walkthroughs So these are the brief introduction about this and this is for placing so if you want to place man here you can use if you want to pl place uh, some furniture here like outdoor furniture I will tell you you can use this place so it is for placing objects in your scene so you can use this place feature and this is for selecting your object if suppose if i want to move this object i can select this and if i want to delete this i can use this delete button and click this and it will get deleted this is for a scaling object here so, so suppose if i want to scale this man i will go to this people and animals and i will select this man here and now I will scale. You can scale. You have to just uh, left click mouse and drag this person. And also you can resize from here. That all will be understanding in the upcoming tutorials. So this is for deleting and this is for undo move. So you can undo your scenes here. This is for deselect all. So this is the brief introduction about this and here it is the build which is this scene entire scene here if you want to take photo of your scene you can take photo if you want to create a movie if you want to return back you can click here build if you want to uh, create a walkthrough here so you, you can select it from here you can 
create your walkthroughs by going here and this is for saving your files so i will click this so first time if you are making scenes you have to first uh, save as your file and after that you can every time you can click this save so i will return by clicking on build and this is for 360 degree panorama and this is for walkthrough and these are some many settings so uh, there are some shortcuts uh, about your scenes so if you press q on your scene so it will go downwards and if you press e it will be moving upwards and if you press w your scene will come forward and if you press uh, a command it will go right right side and if you press d it will go left side and if you press s it will go backwards so you have to remember quits q w e a d s for moving up uh, your scenes and uh, moving left and right so thanks for watching in the next video tutorial we'll be understanding more in lumion so thanks